Hi, we're here with Esports Business Summit with our new Hall of Fame inductee, Ed Boone, co-creator of Mortal Kombat and Injustice. Congratulations. Thank you very much. It's great to be here. So the first thing I wanted to ask you about um, is what you find exciting about the industry right now, since you've been in it for years and successful and constantly reinventing the game. Um, I guess it's it's growth, you know. It's it's um, if you would have asked me ten years ago, you know, is the industry going to get as big as it is now? I never would have guessed it. And so, you know, it's it's influence on other forms of entertainment, and it's become its own, um, you know, sport as it is mm -hmm. um, is is just amazing. So, um, the growth of the industry has been the thing that's surprised me the most. Mm -hmm. So. When it comes to Mortal Kombat, how have you kept it relevant for so many years? Um, change has barely been the, the main thing. Mm -hmm. You know, we, 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 we just finished doing Mortal Kombat 11, and um, with every game, we really want to kind of ask ourselves, what's different about this game that wasn't in any of the previous Mortal Kombat games? You, when, when you do so many sequels, I think it's you, we have a duty to introduce something brand new so the player who's been kind of on this journey with us knows that every new Mortal Kombat game is going to offer something that they haven't experienced before. Where do you look for inspiration, you and your team? I know there's probably a, a ton of you that create this together. Oh, absolutely. You know, all ever since the first Mortal Kombat game, we've we've had a lot of influence by, you know, we were um, children of, of growing up watching movies in the 80s. You know, all the big, you know, Terminator, Alien, the big action movies, RoboCop, um, you know, and, and even even some of the, from the 70s. Um, so movies has been a huge influence in us, and um, it's it's that's what that's been one of the things that's been so uh, great is to see Mortal Kombat become a movie or referenced in a movie, mm -hmm. and so it's it's a nice kind of full circle moment. Mm -hmm. Do you have? Um, I know you thanked a lot of people at your speech. Um, during your speech, but I was wondering if you have any mentors, specific mentors, that have kind of helped you at pivotal points along your career. Absolutely. Um, you know, uh, there was a guy, when I was in, in high school, um, you know, I, I would play arcade games and there was a game called uh, Defender, and the guy who created it, his name is Eugene Jarvis, he created a bunch of, you know, Robotron, Defender, all these games that I played in high school, and I ended up working with him you know, uh, straight out of college. And so that was um, him and Larry DeMar were two guys who were really instrumental in making games in the 80s. And I um, absolutely followed in their footsteps. And so I, I would say those two guys are the my biggest influences. Do you ever think about working for different games or are you just through and through loyal? Um, I'd love to do different games. Um, you know, we've been fortunate enough with Mortal Kombat that that each one has kind of warranted a follow-up, mm -hmm. and that's been that's been really nice, and we really appreciate it. Um, uh, we're, we're always thinking of of new games. You know, we, we started doing Injustice games, and those those have done well for us. And I'd love to do other games as well. But um, we absolutely appreciate the. Uh, the the support that the players have been giving us with Mortal Kombat. Mm -hmm. So, how about esports? Um, what do you play a role in that? Um, do you go to the tournaments? Are you Absolutely. getting more and more into it? Absolutely. Um, I've gone to many many tournaments um, with with our games featured, um, and it's you know there's an energy at a live tournament that is you know you have to experience. Um, it, it's great to see it uh, streamed and uh, telecast, um, but there's an energy in uh, a room or a stadium um, when people are playing that, that that you really need to go to. Um, and so I go whenever I can. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm very busy, but you know, as as, as much um, live participation in esports as I can is is uh, always just drives us to uh, you know make that next game mm -hmm. and have it have that much stronger yeah. motivates you right absolutely yeah. absolutely is Mortal Kombat gonna get more and more uh, the game itself into esports is there a, a plan for that uh, every game that we do we think 
more and more about esports and and mm -hmm. you know the competitive aspect of it. You know, organized competition and you know people just getting good at the game. So um, that's an absolute you know check mark in terms of our must-have features in the game is is a heavy support for esports. <laughs>